What's up guys, it's Leo. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get this sunkissed fresh face glowy look. I've been putting on makeup more because I've been going to a lot of social gatherings. I went to Trinidad, I went to Orlando for a wedding, I went to BeautyCon recently too. I have been using this routine that has not failed me. I'm also going to be showing you guys how I do a little skincare prep thanks to Sephora Collection. And I'm going to be showing you guys some of my favorite products from the Sephora Collection clean skincare line that I've been using recently. Taking care of your skin is essential for makeup use. If you don't take care of your skin, then your makeup will not look good. So a lot of this is skincare prep. Alright, so if you want to see how I got this look, keep on watching. Well, what's up guys, it's Leo. Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be showing you guys two of my favorite products to use from the Sephora Clean Skincare line to use on my skin before makeup. So first we're going to be taking the Sephora Collection Ultra Glow Serum. This has vitamin C and vitamin E in it. Two of my favorite ingredients. Ever since I started using this product, I noticed that my skin has looked more plump and even. And it's also helped to stay hydrated throughout the day. Drip, drip. Shut your face. I can't I like to press this product into my skin. This product has peptides to help smooth and strengthen the skin. I like to use this AM and PM underneath my moisturizer. Now after I apply moisturizer, I'm using the Sephora Collection Brightening Under Eye Cream. Good amount of product here for an eye cream. My under eye circles are the part that I take care of the most, so I love to use a brightening under eye cream. And what I love about this one is that it helps me stay hydrated all day. I noticed that a lot of under eye cream, they tend to like wear off throughout the day, but this one is so creamy and thick that it just it just stays on and you feel the moisture too because I have allergies right now my eyes are just dry I think naturally so this product has hyaluronic acid which is one of my favorite skincare products because it helps to keep your skin moisturized and it also has caffeine in it so it helps to reduce your under eye circles so I really do feel the difference when I use this under eye now ready for makeup for primer I'm going to be using the HelloFab Coconut Skin Smoothie Priming Moisturizer I said it before and I'll say it again I've used this in New York and in Trinidad, and it hasn't failed me yet. But I think I'm just take one pump. Oh! Personality matrix holes and charts. It's all about the bumps in your heart. How your foundation look also has to do a lot with your skincare. So my skin was already pretty nice. And for the concealer, I think I always use this. This is the NARS Soft Matte Complete Concealer. And this just helps to cover anything. I mainly care about my under eyes. Like, as long as my under eyes are brightened, then I feel comfortable with my makeup, you know? When I found this, I was like, hallelujah. Thank you, Auntie Jackie, for introducing me. Becky Ina put me onto this in her videos. Get our powder ready. I have this one by Pretty Vulgar. Okay, I was gonna put on a second concealer, but I'm looking pretty good. you don't get any flashback and it makes your skin look super soft and to get the sunkiss effect you're gonna want a bronzer so i'm taking this fenty beauty bronzer in the shade coco naughty just warming up my face take this bigger brush and attempt to do my nose I always contour my nose, but I really don't know if it works for me. Like, I don't know. My nose is just small. I don't really know where I'm contouring. Create some definition. Okay, I'm gonna zoom a little eyeshadow. I love warm tone colors to give me that sun kissed look. I'm gonna put it on my lower lash line a little bit. Baby, hit it. That's all I'm gonna do for eyeshadow. I'm just so basic. <laughs> so for brows, I'm using my Cabral. You guys know I love this. I'm in the color 5. I think I'm more of a 6, but 5 will do. I can't find my other one, so I had to open a new one. Oh my god, I have not. I have not done my brows like this in so long. Let's, let's get it zoomed in. into leaving my brow hairs like long in the front a little bit long not not too crazy done with the brows this one is definitely sharper since i'm not wearing ballsy today i'm gonna be mixing together two face better than sex and pretty vulgar twist open both of them hold the mirror wait my foot's asleep <laughs> Put 
who needs falsies when you have them? Okay, I think I'm gonna take more of that orange. I always do this after I do mascara because I don't know, I just can see the vision more, you know what I mean? We get crazy and add some pink. It is not ole ole. I feel like people hate blush until they put it on. Like they properly put it on and they're like, whoa, I look cute. I'm like, yeah, girl, you gotta walk around mad. I really need to get a fan. <laughs> I left my highlighting brush upstairs, so... Oh my god. These highlights just look so soft and beautiful. After I set my face, I always put more face powder on. I don't know why. All-time favorite face powder is the Sephora Collection Micro Smooth. And I'm in the color Matte Tan 40. Just take some on a dense brush like this. And I put it like on my chin around here where I get kind of oily right here just to mattify it I don't like to look shiny in those areas at another time real quick and this is the completed sunkissed natural bronzy just came back from Trinidad summertime fine honestly this makeup look is so pretty this makeup yo skincare is a huge part of my makeup routine I feel like if my skin is nice then my makeup won't come out nice so I never do my makeup when my skin isn't nice so make sure you guys check out the Sephora collection clean skincare line down below last week I uploaded a college night routine where I show you guys me steaming my face, pampering myself, and doing my skincare routine. So if you'd like to see more of my skincare routine, make sure to check out that video. I'm gonna go take some Instagram pictures now. That's basically it. I'll see you guys very soon with a new video. Bye!